Purcell is one of the great photographers. She has captured the history of objects by photographing them in romantic decline. It's the majesty of the weird, the majesty of the unheralded, and the contemplation of things that other people would normally just ignore. How much are the duck heads? That's what I've been wondering here for the last uh, oh. half hour. <laughs> Visiting Rosman Purcell's studio is like traveling to another place and another time, but you're not quite sure what that place is or what that time is. I assume the frame of a typewriter. It's vestigial hammers like the ribbings of an ancient sea urchin. When does an inanimate object become worthy of a scientific name? I name the typewriter Underwood Densis Corrupta. Don't you think that if you're looking at something through a lens and visually the field changes because of that, that that is a phenomenon that is worthy of mentioning. You're wondering, is this the virtuosity of the simple geometry of how seashells are made? Who's making that thing beautiful? Well, it's nature, but it's also the photographer who's figured out how to collaborate with nature and heighten it. And that's the art that nature makes.